Hi everybody, I'm here with my little buddy Anakin. Hello. Hello. So this is my son Anakin, we call him Bananas. And he is super duper mega excited to review this 3D wooden dinosaur puzzles because someone... And you can paint it. And you can paint it. Someone may or may not... And build it. Someone may or may not have kind of an obsession with dinosaurs. I don't know who that would be. Do you know who that would be, Anakin? Me. You? You like dinosaurs? Yeah. No way. I had no idea. Um, I like T-Rex and Plesiosaurus. He likes T-Rex and a Plesiosaurus. So here's the box that this comes in. And um, I'm not sure why we need to have all the flags with the different languages on there. But basically, it's a wooden puzzle that, or wooden model that you put together and then you can paint. And it does come with four colors worth of paint. Here's something that I kind of like that was on the front of the box. Is it shows you how to make different colors with your four colors. So this is good um, for kids to learn. And different colors right here. Like yes. the colors that kind of this. Yes, those are the colors that come with it. And here's the big moment, Anakin. You're so excited. <laughs> Whoa, there it is. There it is. So oh, it's, there's the paint. There's the paint. It's inside of there. It's inside of there. So oh, here. I see the bones. Oh, he sees the bones. <laughs> so here it is. Um, let's go ahead and open it up. Oh. So even this is nicely packaged. I mean, I thought oh, the box was nicely packaged, but the, no. The, I bet the instructions are right here. And I apologize for the dog noises in the background. We have a new puppy it's a paintbrush. and a not-so-new dog, it's a and they play brush. non-stop. Yes, it's a paintbrush. Paintbrush, paintbrush. Um, sandpaper. Yes, sandpaper. That's what this is. This is a little square of sandpaper. Ooh. And here is the destructions. The destructions, mm -hmm. or as, as we like to call them, the instructions. So um, I'm not going to sit here and film this whole thing of us putting this together, has, but I just wanted to show you here's the instructions. Green, blue, yellow, and red. That is correct, sir. Those are the different paint colors. This is actually very soft, the wood. It's got a, it's almost oh, like good. a silky finish to it. It's crazy. So we're oh, going to go ahead, we're going to pop these bones out of the yes. sheets. He I and that's good. I have a feeling that we're not going to be able to say we'll work on this tomorrow. I think this is going to happen tonight. So um, gonna, let's hope this goes right together now. smoothly. Yes, because it's going to happen right now. So um, I'll go ahead and pause. And we'll be back with hopefully a put together dinosaur. Ah! See, Anakin, Anakin, say we'll be back. We will be back. All right. Hop on real quick so you can see Anakin popping some of the pieces off of here. Um, so like someone, like this head has another piece and you just kind of pop these off and that's what the sandpaper is for is if there's any leftover splinters or anything, you can take them it's out of there. It's an arm! Whoa! So they do come out somewhat easily, but you just want to sort of treat them gingerly. So, um, Anakin, by the way, is four, he'll be five, not for another like six months. So I'm thinking, I know it says three and up, but I'm thinking... If you've got someone younger than four, you may need to help them with this part. So, we'll be back. Okay, we're more than halfway through our dinosaur. It's going rather quickly, actually. Surprisingly quickly. And what we've been doing is Anakin's been putting the pieces on. And he's been doing a really good job at that. And then Daddy's been helping him by pushing them into where they need to be. One thing we wanted to note, and I already said before, that the wood is nice and soft. We did have one piece that broke... When Anakin was taking it off, we just put a little glue on it, and it was fine. Um, but these, I wanted to, my husband told me I had to point this out. But right here, you'll see little bumps on the edges of the slots. And those are sort of your locking mechanism to keep it from coming apart once it's together. It still will come apart, but not very easily. But you can see what we have so far. We're about, what, 10 minutes in? Yeah. It hasn't been very long at all, and that's with Anakin doing most of the work. Right, dude? Pretty fun, actually. It is pretty fun. So uh, yeah. we're going to keep going. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Anakin's cracking me up, but we're all done with his dinosaur. Yeah! And he's making crazy faces. Yeah. So we got it all put together. We're going to wait to paint it for a little bit. Um, so I'll just put pictures when of it. When we go to the zoo. When we go to the zoo. We're going to um, paint it later. So I'll put pictures up of it finished and painted. But I just wanted to show you in the video part. 
Here's what the finished dinosaur looks like. And I'll actually I'll also put how tall this guy is in the written part of the review because he's quite tall. I like how they made the legs different. Yeah, the, so it's like walking forward. Yeah, the stuff. legs are different lengths, so it looks like it's walking. It is because it's a pattern <coughs> to walk. It's very yeah, stable. It's very stable and it's very cool. And it was actually a and lot of fun like to put together. Head. Yes. So what do you think, Anakin? Do you like your dinosaur? It's amazing. It's amazing. Wow. Now you get to paint it with Grandpa. Yes. So this was a great project to do um, as a parent. Sometimes you get bored doing these or you curse a lot when you're trying to put models together. Not the case with this one. It was smooth sailing, easy to do, and it looks super cool when it's done. And we have a very excited little boy, huh? <laughs> All right, so I think that's it. Like I said, I'll put pictures up of the finished product, but for now, if you have any questions, feel free to leave a comment. My husband's shoving the instructions at me for some reason. I just, I don't know if you pointed them out before, but it does show you the numbers. Each one has got a number in it correlating to the thing so that uh, the instructions so that he was able to identify the shapes uh, by the number so the instructions are very easy the to instructions follow. were very easy to follow and it also helped us work on putting things in largest to smallest order which is um, you know just another learning thing so lots of learning with this and I think that's it so if you have any questions <laughs> feel free to leave a comment and Anakin can you say I hope this was helpful I hope this is helpful bye bye